So heading over to the local Goodwill. Not sure if I'll find a lot. It's pretty hot here. We had planned on going to one of the flea markets in the area, but they only have them on Wednesday and Sunday. And today's a day I like to go and other stuff happened. So that didn't happen. So I'm just going to hit up one or two thrift stores today and see how that goes. Let's go. I just had to get this. It goes all the way down. Don't mind the floor. Needs carpet, but yes, I love this lamp. I love it. Actually, to put it in the truck, it did come apart at this. Came it not apart, but it just screwed up. So we'll see. But check out the comps on spaghetti lucite lamps. I am torn be between keeping it because I love it so much, but I love reselling. I could. Pro I'm thinking if I did sell it, I might put five hundred dollars on it, maybe a little bit more. But this one. I think it's going to be a keeper. Anyway, let's check out this haul video. So the first item I'm going to start out with is really cool. I think I paid $2.99 for this. I think he's from A Bug's Life. He does have a little button here. You have to push it and it does make a noise. But this is cool. I paid $2.99 for him. So well, that's that. Now I do want to share two or three items from the other day. I picked up for free and now I'm not going to show you the whole set, but right now, if you look up poinsettia stuff, the comps are pretty good. Now this, these poinsettia dishes would have been in a dumpster had I had not told her I was a reseller. So please let them know that you do resell. And this is the second time this thrift store had given me boxes of stuff. Now this is one of the items I had gotten at the thrift store. There were only, f I didn't look this up. I picked it up as soon as I picked this figure up. I brought it home. I looked it up in the truck and there were four listed. And this is a uh, Largo. It's hard to see, but it is signed on the bottom. It's like a cast bronze figure. <sighs> Very good figure. I'm happy I picked it up. I have it listed over $100. I will leave it over $100 for a few months, and then I'll come down in price. I know I've seen some listings go for $50 or more. So this was a good pickup. I'm hoping. I'm a little bit slow today. And the reason for this is it is 10 to 8 in the morning. It is early in the morning. I never record this early. I usually record in the afternoon. I had the house to myself and I thought, you know what, Patty, get a video up. Get a video up. So this is what I'm doing. I did a video the other day on uh, some plush. If you don't know already, these are puppy surprises. And in the bottom, they have little puppies in them. Now, this actually makes like a little, they have little puppies in them. There's two of them in here. But if you don't know, if you see these, especially the ones from the 90s. Now, this one is from like 2016 or something. But if you see them from the 90s, they are really good sellers. Look up the comps on these puppy surprises. And if you, now this one will sell. This one's just going to take a little bit more time. Look up the comps on these puppy surprises, especially if they're from the 90s. This one isn't. This will still sell eventually, but the ones from the 90s you can get a pretty good buck for. And that's puppy surprises. And sometimes you can find them without the puppies. I had found one before without the puppies. It was a pink one. 
I don't think I listed it though, which I have to get around to doing that. I did pick up this walkie-talkie. I paid $2 for this. And the case, I do have the case for it. This looks, the box looks really bad, but this looks like it was never, ever used. It does take eight batteries, so I do have to test this. And if I don't, I'm just going to put in the listing that it wasn't tested. On to some plush, my, one of my favorite things to sell. Paid a dollar. And I got this because I just picked this up because it was, it was, he was cute, which a lot of plush are cute, but this one had the little Christmas hat and I think he'll do well around Christmas time. So I picked this one up because I sold a gorilla like this, not with the heart, but a little bit bigger than this. I sold a gorilla for, I think it was $39.99, probably about two months ago. So. This is why I picked this up and he's a pretty decent size. And of course he has this heart, just a little bit different. Now, this is just, we're not in the season, but the size of this bunny. The condition on this bunny was really, really good. I paid $3 for him because of the size. I want to see. Now, when I do the title for this bunny, I will put child lifelike size, you know, something or huge in the title to draw attention to the listing and I want that buyer to click on the on the item to see what it looks like. Now this I got for me. <laughs> I had to, I couldn't pass it up. It was $5. It's a what? I don't even I I had to get it. $5. I think I'm going to keep it though. Not marked that I could see, but I know he's vintage. Just cute. Now, some of these I have to put my glasses on. I don't have any of these, so I picked this up, a donkey. That's the only reason I picked him up. He doesn't even have a tag. I paid a dollar. No tag. No tag, but... He was a donkey. I don't have any in my store and I want one. I paid a dollar for this Build-A-Bear Glisten. I didn't look up the comps on these. There was a whole big basket of plush and I just go through them and buy them. And that's just the way I do it. I don't these chip in Dales. This is a Disney. And this is Dale. The, this is just a plain Gaffa. But these when they touch the little sequins, they their color change in. Now this is a smaller one. This. This is a Gans. I picked it up because I'm not sure if it was tested or not. It, uh, this is a Webkins. Still in the thing. Paid a dollar. Another dollar one. This one was just different. Looks to be vintage. Here's another uh, Gans, a walrus. A 
I'm having iced tea in the morning. I'm having home-brewed iced tea this morning instead of my normal uh, cup of tea or coffee. This nativity set, right now around the holidays, this was $2.99. If you see nativity sets, I didn't, like I said, I did not, I didn't look this up when I was in the store, but this was sealed and not sealed, it was just sealed with tape. And when I got to the register, even though it was $3, I asked her if I can open it up and see if all the pieces were there. So basically, I didn't open the whole thing up. I just looked and I seen that. That's what I seen. And I thought, you know what, take a chance. It doesn't look like anything's broke. Hopefully, baby Jesus is in there. We'll see. Not probably. Uh, this, this doesn't look like it's a high-end brand. But around the holidays, people love to have these nativity sets. So if you see them, I highly recommend either looking them up or buy them if you can get them at a good price. Even the individual pieces of them sell. Now this is one of the dream work trolls. The sparkly hair. He was only, it was, well, this one has 99 cents on it and $1.99. She mentioned to me, to me this at the register. I have no idea what she charged me. I just looked at her like, I, you know, whatever. Because I was just throwing them in. I wasn't really looking at the prices when I was getting them. I'm happy I got this because it's still, I probably would have bypassed this if it didn't have the, uh, Disney tag, but the tag was still on it, so I picked him up. This, I never seen one like him, this bear. I usually don't pick up bears unless they're like collectible bears, like Boyd's Bears or something like that. This one was $1.99, but look at him. He looks like a, a like just I had to pick him up. There was no re there was no way I was going to leave this bear behind. He may sit, he may not, I don't know, but he was going home for me for $2. And he's a nice size. I the 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 tag is wore off, so Oh, I picked him up. I don't remember getting him. I don't know why I picked him up. I didn't because I wouldn't have got this. But he's in my uh, box here. Maybe my husband threw him in. Who knows? But it says IKEA. I wouldn't have got that though. This I got this bunny. I have one listed that. It's only around this size. I have it listed at $19.99, and I have gotten a, quite a few questions if it still works. I didn't even know it did anything because it didn't have anything that I felt in it, but apparently, I guess that type of bunny worked or made some kind of a noise, and so this one actually does have the squeeze box in it. Hopefully, it works when I put some batteries in it that you... Oh! It does. Look. How cute is that? Yeah, so I'm excited to list this. This I got for free. Still in a box. Brand new. I got this for free too. As soon as I seen it, um, I picked it up. A Ronald Reagan mask. It's a vintage rubber mask. I have this at $44. I had to uh, so, as soon as I listed it within 10 minutes, I had somebody offer me 30. I got it for free. I didn't take it. When I go into a thrift store, I go directly to depend on what store it is, but I, I will go directly to the toy section and I will look at the plush and all the toys. If I see, I'll go right to the plush, and if I see bags of toys, I'm right there looking at those bags of toys and 
seeing what they got. I'm not really familiar with these, but I picked up this little bag for $1.99, and from what I could tell, they have little S's on them, so I'm thinking they're for their little Shopkin accessories. So I have no doubt that I'm going to be able to sell these in a lot, or depending what's in here, some of them I may be selling separately. This bag, again, this was $2, $1.99. When I seen that Disney tag, I thought, hmm, what's in that bag? And then I seen another, so I'm going to open this little Disney bag with you guys. Now, I don't know if this video will be up tonight. Today's my son's birthday, my oldest son's birthday. He's 35 years old. I feel so old. I was 18, 35 years ago, I was 18 years old. And uh, yeah, so today's his 35th birthday. Happy birthday, John. And I'm gonna go, over, we're gonna go over and visit him later on today. So I don't know if I'll have time to be getting this video up tonight or tomorrow night but at least I got it done I could say I got it done but yeah let's see what's in here oh my gosh I don't even know look at these little creatures I love little things that oh, he's so cute look at him oh my gosh look at this guy I know I get excited I don't even know why because I'll probably get a buck for it but they're just cute. How do you, how do you not think they're, how do you not pick these up? Like I picked up this bag. I said to my, how did you pass that? But it looks like these are all new with tags. And I only paid $2 for that bag. For this bag. Look. I don't know these guys, so I'll be doing, I'll be using Google Lens because I have, I am clueless. And here's the last one. Oh my gosh. Yes, yeah, so that's my one thrift store haul video and a few free items I picked up along the way. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please give me a like, leave me a comment, and please subscribe. Thank you for being here. I truly, truly appreciate you all. Take care.